perfect shot! Hi guys and welcome to the next tutorial of Tool 9, the 6 star hotel. Before we start, please subscribe to uh, my YouTube channel, follow me on Twitch where I th stream three times a week. My name there is also Golf Clash Tommy. So, Tour 9 and we get this part 5. I love this part 5 actually because it's uh, it's a tricky one, definitely a tricky one. Uh, for those people who watched my opening round, uh, my qualifying round, sorry, uh, they saw that I did go into uh, into the uh, the rough in front, and I'm going to play this uh, in uh, in one way that you could be playing because I have some kind of um, uh, tailwind, but I'm just gonna put it up just short because this is the normal way to play this course. Uh, it's a long par 5 and it's hard to do an eagle on this one. Uh, and the hardest part is actually to reach in two. So I'm just doing my drive, putting myself up there using one in backspin. Want to stay as close to the, to the rough uh, as possible to uh, be able to go, uh, go to the fourth fairway actually. If you have a tailwind, a good tailwind and some good front spin on your club, you will be able to reach to the second fairway if you hit it almost as hard as you can. The, uh, the hard part is to make it stop on the second fairway, but if you want to reach, uh, reach for the green in two, you need to have some good wind with your drive and go over the bunker and stay on that fairway. Also have in mind, uh, especially in the tournament, that use a club that you have uh, some distance with. Uh, and the club that I mean then, it's your wood club. Use Cataclysm, the big dog, uh, because then you have some length and you also have some topspin to be able to, uh, to go for green in two. Now we're having, uh, I'm having the sniper. Uh, and as you can see, I uh, have a really hard time to reach here. Uh, which uh, means that I can go three ways. I can go max overpower and try to get it over there. I can go this and curl it in and use my side spin to curl it up there. Or I can go on this platform here. I'm going with this uh, suggestion here. Uh, I'm using max top spin because I want. I'm going to curl my ball as uh, much as possible. As you can see, and the curl together with the side spin will uh, make my ball uh, fly down right instead of just flying into the rough. If I was just going straight, and that's one way to do that that approach shot. And as you can see, this is uh, a par five, and we are just on that fairway, uh, uh, far from far from the green uh, for doing an eagle. Uh, and this is the most common way to play this hole and go for uh, have uh, lay yourself up for an eagle and uh, and if you miss you do an easy birdie uh, but I uh, have done it myself and if you have some good wind with your drive you uh, you <laughs> you drive it over over the, uh, the bunker and the rough and stay on that second fairway and then you have a club uh, as I had the, uh, the big dog and once with the cataclysm as well, uh, you uh, need to do uh, possibly max power, depending on the wind, using the side spin uh, of your club and uh, and also the top spin, the side spin of your ball and the top spin of your club, uh, and that's one way to go into the bunker. Why didn't I go to this this spot over here? I didn't go to this spot over here because I think this approach shot is harder to do than this one when you don't have the bunker in play. Uh, so that's the reason I go this way uh, instead of that spot. And also to just reach out there depending on what wind you have, it's definitely a hard one to to make it stay, especially if you don't have uh, much uh, uh, backspin on your club. And then you need to do aim it into the rough and let the rough do the work, and that's a hard shot to do. 
So I'm just aiming myself up there, adjusting for the wind like that. Hitting it perfect, and this one will go a bit to the right. But that will, uh, in that case, be an easy birdie. And once again, I have been talking about this um, uh, a lot now in this video. Uh, once again, uh, start from the beginning by check the wind, of course. If you have some headwind, try to, or sidewind, try to stay as close to the rough. Uh, at front, uh, in front as possible. Uh, if you have tailwind, but you don't feel certain enough, uh, you maybe don't have that good rough iron, uh, a good rough iron or a sandwich with no distance with, then lay yourself up instead and as uh, as far up to the rough as possible. If you have some top spin on your drive and you also feel that you you would be able to reach from the bunker and from the rough if you miss it completely then try to go over to the second fairway and that's the only the only way to be able to reach this green in two and that's uh, and also make sure that for the tournament use a club for you uh, as you would uh, with some distance on it and that's really really important to know i changed before this hole to get my uh, big dog or the Cataclysm and for the third shot if you have uh, for the second shot If you can't reach uh, try to go to a fairway spot where you will be able to reach uh, For the green and lay yourself up to have a shot uh, shipping for the eagle that third shot for the eagle will be hard But you at least have a shot, but most people do a birdie on this hole so if you do a birdie in the tournament, don't be sad. Uh, just take it as a uh, as a birdie that sh you would be needed to have. And also in the regular tool play, uh, it's definitely a birdie uh, to go for and then try to bash it in the shootout. Because if you miss your drive completely uh, uh, and go short, you will have a hard time to uh, to even reach for the birdie. And guys, subscribe to the channel. Please comment and uh, say what you think and like this video. Follow Golf Clash Elite on Facebook.